In this video, we will show you the easy steps we use to create this spectacular floating balloon decoration without helium for the ceiling. You will need at least three complementary balloon colors. We chose regular 12 inch round balloons in yellow, dark and light purple. The secret ingredient in this balloon decor idea is balloon glue dots. You will need a few rolls of ribbon. The higher your ceiling, the more you will need. A pair of scissors is needed for cutting the ribbon to the required length. Finally, you will need a balloon inflator to pump all your balloons. Now, let's get started. You will need at least three complementary balloon colors. We chose yellow and two shades of purple, one dark and one light. Feel free to add other decorative balloons such as confetti or polka dot. Use your scissors to cut strips of ribbon to the length you desire. You want the string to hang about 4 feet from the ground. For our 9 foot high ceiling, we used 4 and a half feet of ribbon per balloon. To get the correct length, measure the height of your ceiling and then subtract 4 feet and 6 inches. 4 feet is the distance from the floor and 6 inches for the difference in the height of your balloon and the extra length for tying. The next step is to inflate all your balloons. You can use a manual or electric pump. Electric pumps are a bit more expensive, but they are faster and they will not tire you out, especially when inflating a lot of balloons. While inflating your balloons, it is more convenient to tie them to the ribbons at the same time. This reduces the additional work of going through all the balloons once again just to pair them to the strings. Balloons are fun for the entire family. Using a balloon tying tool makes tying a balloon and adding the ribbons super fast and very easy. Here is a quick tutorial on how to use a balloon tying tool. Place the balloon tying tool on your index and middle fingers. Put the inflated balloon between your thumb and index finger and seal the neck of the balloon with your thumb. Stretch the balloon over the tying tool to about 6 inches in length. Wrap it around the tying tool and secure it in one of the grooves against your palm. Pass the string or ribbon under the stretched balloon neck and secure it there. Remove the mouth of the balloon from its secured position and pass it under the stretched neck to make a knot. Pull firmly on the balloon until the knot has slipped off the balloon tool. You have now tied a ribboned balloon ready for floating. Repeat this procedure for all your balloons until you are complete. How many balloons do you need for the no helium floating balloon ceiling arrangement? You will need just a little over one balloon per square foot. For our space of 8 foot by 10 foot, 80 square feet, we used 88 balloons. We distributed the colors equally between the dark and light purples and the vibrant yellow. There you have it. All our balloons are inflated, creating a sea of beautiful, vibrant colors. 
they look spectacular. Do you like what you see so far? Then click the like button and subscribe to our channel so you can get more amazing videos like these. We then transported the balloons to the area we plan to use them for the setup. You can inflate your balloons up to 48 hours before the actual decoration. We left these balloons up for almost two weeks and only a few of them deflated. The main disadvantage is that after a few days, they lost their newly inflated shine for a matte powdery look. We used a small stool to reach our 9 foot high ceiling. You may need a step ladder for higher ceilings. From there, the process is simply placing the balloons on the ceiling in your desired pattern. We tried as much as possible to not have the same color of balloons in close proximity. But how did we get the balloons to float without helium? We used our secret ingredient, balloon glue dots. Take one to two dots of glue from off the strip and stick them to each balloon. Two or more glue dots will keep heavier balloons secured to the ceiling. Then reach up and stick your balloon to the ceiling. Simple as that. This gives the illusion that your balloons are filled with helium and have floated up and touched the ceiling. A tip to ensure your balloons remain stuck to the ceiling is, before making your arrangement, use a damp cloth to remove any dust particles that may prevent the adhesive on the glue dots from losing its stickiness. After ensuring that the surface is clean and dry, stick your balloons to the ceiling. The glue dots work best on very smooth surfaces. Rough surfaces may not offer enough surface area for effective sticking. Then voila! Behold, the marvelous arrangement of floating balloons without helium in all its majestic glory.
That's all, folks. See the full how-to article on our website, balloonblowout.com, to get step-by-step -step instructions, more color options, arrangement ideas, and links for every resource we used. So you can create your very own ceiling floating balloon decoration and many others. We have other great no helium floating balloon design videos on our channel. Feel free to check them out for more inspiration and instructions. If you found this video useful and would like others to see it, please smash that like button and subscribe to our channel to see more extraordinary balloon decoration ideas.